Hey everyone, uh, thanks for waiting, welcome back. It took a while, but I got my car. Originally I was scheduled to pick it up on Thursday, but they emailed me on Wednesday saying that I couldn't have an out-of-state license and that I needed a PA license. Um, so the service advisor pushed it back to Saturday night, which gave me enough time to overnight the documents I needed to get a PA license to switch it from an out-of-state to an in-state license on Saturday morning and then go pick up my car Saturday at 5. Um, but if I wasn't able to do that, he said that he wasn't able to hold it and that Tesla might cancel my order. So I'd be out of out of like an order that was at a lower price and I'd have to reorder at a higher price and wait even longer. Um, so I'm very glad to have uh, gotten that over with. And I can talk about the process. Um, so I Ubered over there and so I walk into the, the service center and very empty. I, I get greeted by the guy at the front desk and he's like, hey Roger, welcome. And it was all very hands off. Uh, he just took my license and then showed me my car and he said, you know, take a look as long as you need. Uh, all the instructions are in the videos. Um, but if I had any questions, I'd ask him. Um, I didn't watch the videos. So the experience was very shocking. There are so many controls. There are so many. It's like getting a new phone. And then you're like overwhelmed by all the settings that you can change. Like say you switch from like a flip phone to an iPhone. And you're like, oh shit, you have so many settings to switch on and off. Like you hear about the one pedal driving, but you don't know what setting to switch to. You don't know how to change the mirrors on the side. So it was all very uh, overwhelming. Um, so I highly suggest you watch all the videos that they give you. Because after the night, after I got home, I watched all the videos and explained everything. So I probably should have done that earlier. Um, but yeah, I picked up my car. I brought my floor mats, my Tasmanian floor mats, um, and they fit like a charm. They're really great. I really like them. They're kind of like a soft but firm rubber, so they feel good on your feet. Um, but at the same time, you know, like it's protected, um, and they're pretty thick, so it's pretty nice. Um, I did get the Ryzen processor, um, so I'm very happy with that. The car came with five miles, which is cool, great for a new car did a very brief inspection I didn't like go in depth like into every seat into the back um, it was also getting dark when I drove off the lot it was already dark um, so I suggest you schedule it you know when there's more daylight um, so you can kind of see your car better um, but I did inspect the outside um, the panel gaps I didn't see many panel gaps um, the rear bumper is like kind of very close to the side fender so but they were both on both sides really close so I guess that's fine um, the trim on the windows um, they're a little higher than the other like at the joints one thing was that was funky was the the front lid um, it was kind of uneven it was like tilted a little bit um, but I found out that you can turn the knobs on the back of the frunk. You can like twist it so it'll raise or lower uh, when you set it down. And I was able to do that myself. I didn't have to do like a service request through the phone. So I was able to park it in a garage and charge it for the first time. Um, and I was able to park next to a... Uh, Mustang Mach-E, so that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, so I didn't check the rear windows to see if they were like double paned or something, and I didn't check the uh, the battery in the in the front of the car to see if it was a lithium ion. But I'll check later. Um, personally, I don't really care, um, but I am curious. It's just been really cold, and I haven't had much time to go out during the daylight. To film it because I park in a garage and I live in an apartment um, but yeah I'll check I'll report back the results um, thanks for watching
please like, subscribe. Um, hope to bring more footage, maybe some adventures. Uh, but thanks. See ya.